with butter and jam. Then at lunchtime, you prepare a sandwich. Green eggs and ham. And for dinner, you're smoking pot roast. Cranberries from the can. So when it's time. Doubleheader, how about that? 
So I started out with Ain't Got No Time and then ended up with uh, Melodic Attraction. So I'm going to go down and meet Igor Le Chapeau at uh, the uh, Escargot Underground um, Radio Cabaret tonight down at L'Hirondelle if you'd like to join. He wants some videography done so uh, I uh, agreed to his terms and we're going to get some footage laid. We're going to shoot some footage and... Um, so that should be a good time. I'm going to have to leave here pretty soon. But um, the other night, I was at a vernissage. A friend of mine, Nella, Pat, my pal. She sets me up with a lot of shows, so that's cool. And speaking of that, when I was down there, the proprietor, Jean-Marc, of the uh, Ecomusée uh, Gallery, on Montmartre, it's kind of down on the back, uh, behind, sloping side of Montmartre. You can look up the street, Rue de Cave, and uh, the, the Sacre Coeur is right there, all lit up, all nice, like a wedding cake, and um, he, uh, they have, uh, he's got uh, like 300 works of art on the wall, it looks like it was an old restaurant that he uh, turned into a museum, or a uh, gallery, and uh, he asked me, he invited me to put up a couple pieces, and I'm like, yeah. but the restriction is, is that the pieces are all 30 by 30 centimeters, and I of course have no pieces that are 30 by 30, I have some 40 by 40s, I have a 50 by 50, but, and, uh, yeah, but n no 30 by 30s. So he said to me, oh, okay, see you tomorrow. I'm like, what? And so yesterday I had, uh, while I was doing my yoga, I had this strange uh, observation. It wasn't an epiphany because an epiphany, oftentimes I was talking with my pal Carmelo about how I get ideas for the artworks. And uh, usually it's sort of like a lightning strike. Everything comes together all at once. You get an image in your mind. But this was different. This was actually something I perceived. So what happened was I was looking out the window and there's a chimney out there and the sky was bright behind it, the chimney in silhouette, and that was burned onto my retina. And so when I was down doing the, the push-ups of the downward dog or whatever it may be, I saw this reverse image of uh, the chimney against the blue sky. And so uh, I decided that I'd make a few pieces like that. Here's one of them. You see that? So the chimney, which was usually the light color, and the sky, which is usually the blue, it's a reversed image. Then I did another, I did a few. Here's the same subject matter, a little different treatment. Here's a mistake right here. What happened was I sprayed my hand. You can see, still see it on my pinky there, some blue. I sprayed my hand with the spray can accidentally and uh, managed to drip some, uh, some paint onto the paper there. And then uh, what I did was I... Uh, Oh, and you see my signature there? Can you see that? Let's see. Down at the bottom. And uh, black on black. I love black. And um, uh, filled in the silhouette with, with uh, India ink. So it's, you've got some nice effects. That's fun, huh? And here's another one. Familiar subject matter. But this is my favorite right here. I just like how this one turned out. The background is all uh, spray paint. Ah, it's hard to see on this camera, but it's got a, a real um, sort of uh, 60s psychedelic uh, separation of the color values there. They really pop when you see it in real life. So these are available. I'm gonna put uh, at least one of these up in the gallery. I'm gonna, I've been working today on another series but it's the same one but it's going to be a positive image and i'm going to use the palimpsest uh, paper collage uh, technique to create the texture for the chimney part and then the sky is going to be a normal blue but i'm going to treat it more in this halo manner so that should be fun so if you're interested in that just uh, feel free to reach out you can go uh, visit my website if you uh, have any uh, last-minute Christmas shopping to do. Hint, hint, wink, wink. And I also have a PayPal button there if you want to do me a solid and drop me some dosh so that I can keep bringing you this wonderful um, podcast and musical entertainment. Stuck in the middle It's a bit of a riddle About the you and the me 